The horses are entering the starting gates, both number one, Silky Senator, and number two, Abby's Kasherin. Number three, Senator Woot. Number four is, I think, Icon, making her lifetime debut. Two left to load. They are number five, Caraway's Jet Moon, and number six, People Are Crazy. In this first race for maiden two-year-olds, running for a purse of $14,400. Last horse in. They're at the post. And they're off. Towards the inside is Silky Senator in the center is I think Icon and from the extreme outside people are crazy. Silky Senator leads by two open lengths. Second in the center of the track is Senator Wood and from the far outside people are crazy. Silky Senator will not disappoint at two to five. Senator Wood was second and we're going to have a show photo. In the photograph, the unofficial winner of the first race was number one, Silky Senator. Number three, Senator Woot finished second. And number six, People Are Crazy finished third. We had a dead heat for fourth place between both number four, I Think Icon, and number five, Caraway's Jet Moon. Also, attention, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Stewart's Inquiry in this first race regarding the fourth place finishers in a dead heat. Both the number four, I think Icon, and number five, Caraway's Jet Moon, are involved in an inquiry, so this race is under review by the stewards. Hold all tickets, please, until the first race has been posted official.
The handicapping contest is underway, and maybe everybody is alive still because the big favorite, Silky Senator, won. And we've been waiting for this filly to win her maiden. I'm sure you have too, uh, Ramiro. And uh, the combination's back again, Pasco and Ramiro. Emily, Emily Obu owns Silky Senator. Uh, tell me, uh, Ramiro, uh, she was coming out of the John Deere race. You had to be pretty confident about her chances today. Yeah, last time in the stake, this filly no feel comfortable. So today, really nice, easy race. Uh, win. Yeah. <laughs> Winning is good. Now, I don't know how many people out there know that Ramiro does double duty during the week because he rides thoroughbreds at Fort Erie, and he had a winner recently. Um, how are you enjoying Fort Erie? It's amazing track, eh? Yeah, yeah nice people. That's great. So maybe one day we'll see some thoroughbreds racing here, and then you'll be really having fun. Wow, so great. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> well, congratulations, and uh, good luck the rest of the day. Thank you, Jenny. If I can have your attention, ladies and gentlemen, after your re review of the video, the stewards have determined that the number four horse, I think I can was the cause of the interference out at the start against the number five, Caraway's Jet Moon, and they have disqualified her from fourth and placed her fifth. The new numbers will be now 1365. 1365, the four has been disqualified from fourth in a dead heat and placed fifth. The five, Caraway's Jet Moon, is still fourth. First race is now official. The winner is number one, Silky Senator, two-year-old filly by Louisiana Senator out of Denali Peak by Royal Quick Dash. Fold in Oklahoma by Charles Robinson, Silky Senator is owned by Emily Obu, trained by Jason Pasco, and ridden to victory by jockey Ramiro Sanchez Castillo. Silky Senator winning the distance with a time of 17.39 seconds, carrying a speed index of 80. Second number three, Senator Woot. Third number six, People Are Crazy. And fourth number five, Caraway's Jet Moon. Here now are the total results of the first race from top to bottom in your programs. Number one, Silky Senator, the race winner, with a time of 17.39 seconds. Number two, Abby's Cash was sixth, with a time of 17.94 seconds. Number three, Senator Woot finished second, with a time of 17.56 seconds. Number four, I think Icon finished fourth in a dead heat, but was disqualified and placed fifth, with a time of 17.79 seconds. Number five, Caraway's Jet Moon was fourth in a dead heat, and is now fourth, with a time of 17.79 seconds. And number six, People Are Crazy finished third, also with a time of 17.79 seconds. Rechecking from top to bottom, the new order of finishing your program should read 162543.